Ho, 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 it is time now to imagine it with the puddles of lait here and the chief chef, uh, Carl Nelson. <laughs> I'm really not good at a French accent, but I, I thought maybe we'd do something for the kitchen here. What's okay. happening? We're going to do a really cool experiment that you can do at home with stuff you already have. Uh, milk, detergent, little food coloring. But before we do that, I want to sort of set this up. We're going to be talking about surface tension today. Okay, right. and I've got a tray of water and a really fine powder. I'm gonna sprinkle some of this powder on top of this plate of water. I wanna get a fine layer of powder on top so we can kind of observe the surface of the water. Now, the uh, water molecules at the surface, at that interface between the water and the air, are experiencing kind of a tension because there are water molecules below but not above. That's and why it's so tense. And it's almost like the surface of a balloon. Okay. See, I'm not even gonna laugh at that. All right. Okay, so <laughs> I've got some detergent here. And what I want you to do very carefully, don't touch the table. We want that to be very still. Right. I want you to bring the tip of this over and just touch the surface right in the center of the plate. Now, I think I've seen what happens here before. So Try I'm gonna go it. slowly. Go slow. Whoa. <sighs> Look at that. So the detergent molecules have two ends, one end that likes water, one end that doesn't like water. They basically get in between the water molecules and reduce the surface tension, allowing the water surface to sort of fly back like that. That's what you said, like a balloon. Like a balloon, wow. yeah. Now, if you try to do it again, um, you know, it's not gonna happen. Nothing else is gonna happen. Well, maybe, yeah. a, little, maybe a little bit. Right. I lied. Okay, so <laughs> a little bit will happen there. But we're gonna use that property of surface tension and detergents uh, with these trays of milk. So I've got some food coloring for you. Go ahead and right. make a little puddle of food coloring sort of right in the middle, like four or five drops. We'll use some different colors here. And try, try your green as well. Okay, in here? Yeah, yeah, just keep making a little puddle. And what we're gonna do is this, uh, deter this detergent we're gonna add is going to reduce the surface tension, but it's also going to attach itself to the fat molecules that are in the milk. This is whole milk. Okay. okay, so there's a lot of fat in there. And the way detergent works is it attaches to fat molecules and sort of surrounds them, and that way you can rinse them away. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this little sponge, we're going to coat it with detergent, and I'm going to give you the fun part. You're going to take this, the detergent end, and just place it straight down, plunge it straight down into the middle of the tray. this is instead of forcing the molecules away, it's well, actually attracting just, some fat just, molecules? Just watch and see what okay. happens here. There's two things happening. One, Whoa. okay, that was that breaking, and you can leave it in there. Oh, all yeah, right. Leave it in all there. Right. Yeah. You, you can break that surface tension, the water sort of flies away, yeah. dragging the food coloring molecules along with it. Simultaneously, here I got another tray over here, let's try okay. this one. We'll do the same sort of thing. Simultaneously, the detergent is attacking or uh, impaling attaching. itself, impaling. attaching itself to the fat molecules wow. that's inside the milk. And that's kind of what causes that churning action that's going around inside there. It looks like a Pink Floyd video. It is so cool. And you know what? You can <laughs> even, you can take it again and try a different location and you get a little bit more oh, mixing right there. So it's not necessarily like a one and done thing because some of the uh, fat molecules over here have not on Saturdays get in free with a paid adult admission. Absolutely. Thanks Come again back. for this experiment you can take with you. And that is how you imagine it.